Welcome to the shortwave radio channel. And so as we're continuing to uh, decode signals for the uh, digital calling system uh, for boats, uh, what happens is the uh, digital selective calling has all sorts of information. And we see here that I had decoded four things. Um, and one of them that is interesting to uh, check out, and we're going to use the last transmission I got, uh, we have here from, and there's a ship, a new venture, and the uh, number here is the call sign, so D5HI5 is, is call sign, and it's a cargo ship. What is interesting when you search is that, so for example, new venture, the name of this ship, there's a lot of ships named new venture. How do you know which one it is? Well, this number here that you have just behind it is the number that identifies the specific ship. It is a nine digit uh, identification number. And simply go to a website like this one, marinetraffic.com. So here you see all the boats at sea, which is just mind boggling when you think about it. Now on the upper right, you see search marine traffic. And here you can actually search using that nine digit number. I've already searched it. You see here 6360166697. When you search, you can go down here and, and click MMSI, which is the uh, marine number assigned to this ship. When you have here, you can click on the ship. You can click the uh, live map information on the ship where it's going to show you uh, where it is. Not all the time accurate uh, because there are features on this map that are actually um, paid features. But anyways, uh, kind of cool to uh, have information. If you want, you can get even more information off of. You can click the ship itself, have the information where it's go, where it's coming from, where it's going. Uh, you can of course also have pictures of um, you know the ship itself. So here it says new venture, it's a bulk carrier, it's number, and you can click, and it's even going to show you what the boat looks like, which is kind of cool when you think about it. So these are a lot of little details you can get here. Uh, of course, you can get newer positions, but you see here there's little padlocks. Some of the information that they give is paid, f so you need to pay for the information. For free, you get limited amount of information, but at least it's kind of cool because you still know the ship, see what it is, and on some of them you have more details than others. It depends on the ship that you'll decode. So I'm going to share the uh, website marinetraffic.com on the uh, in the description below, and of course you can use that information taken from your DSC decoder. So it's kind of cool, uh, really really nice. The first time that I do this today and uh, having a lot of fun. This is all about you know trying new things to make the hobby fun again. If you find that you're in a kind of a, in a doldrum, you know, where you don't know. And we're going to talk about that in a separate video. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.